what's up everyone welcome back to keto blogging and in today's video we are going to see how we can create a hero section like this in our blogger website so as you can see i created a hero section like this in my wordpress website and i want to design the same hero section for blogger website so as you can see this is a blogger website and here i am using super mac template so you can implement it with any other templates as well so make sure to follow the video carefully and follow the steps as shown in this video and before we start the video make sure to hit the like button so first of all let's go to blogger dashboard and create a section where we are going to add the hero section so let's go to layout here and let's check how the layout looks so as you can see we have the feature post section this is the feature post section and then we have the trending post and then we have the latest post so you can see the layout as well we have the feature post trending post and the latest post so we need to add that hero section just above the feature post so for this let's go to theme and before we make any changes make sure to take a backup of your theme so that if you do any mistake in the process then you can easily restore it using the backup file just click on edit html and copy and paste the old xml file all right now let's search for that popular post section here just click on that and here you can see this is the wizard code and before that we have the section so this is the sections where the feature post is added so we need to select the main class here so let me click on here this is the section and before that we have the deep class and before that the if condition data view each home page so the feature post is only showing in the home page so we new also need to add a hero section that will show on the home page only so for this i will copy a code like this so just copy it and just paste it here and here also we have added the if condition that will only load in the home page so if you want to load this code in different page like post page or archive pages then you can change the blogger conditional tag so i have already made a video on how to use blogger conditional tag so you can watch that video link will be given in the description all right once you add that section make sure to choose a unique wizard id so if there is already same wizard id present then you can change this number like 100 200 250 201 something like that so let me save it first and if it is unique then it will be saved in your theme all right now it is updated let's go back and let's go to the layout now let's scroll down and we have created a new section hero section and we have the hero section wizard just click on the pencil icon here we need to remove this title now we need to copy a code like this so as you can see we have added a h1 tag and after that we have the h2 tag and paragraph tag and we have added two buttons one is for articles one is for service so we can change the button text here and you can change the link here as well just replace the text and links according to your choice and you can replace the text as well and you can also change this heading from h1 to h2 and h2 to h3 then you can just replace the h1 to h2 and h2 to h3 in the css as well all right let me copy it and let's go to layout and in the content section we will paste it and let's hit save now let's open this block here and as you can see we have added a hero section in our super mac theme so you can add the same hero section in any other theme as well so as you can see we have the popular post and trending post so we have added this and if i click on the article it will open the latest post that is the url forward slash search so if you go to this url then it will show the latest post in your blogger website and you can also link to a different page like about us page or services page or any other pages you want to highlight then you can add it here as well now let's check how it looks in the mobile devices and this is how it looks so let me switch to mobile and it will looks good in mobile as well so this is how we can add a hero section to your blogger website and you can easily change the text and you can change the button so let's go to layout click on edit now suppose i want to change this blogging to let's say seo tips 
and let's hit save and let me refresh it as you can see we have changed the text like this and you can also change this color for this let's go to layout click on edit and we have all the css options so this is the main hero sections and we have used a background color like this so suppose you want to add a different background color then you can just right click on it click on inspect and here you can click on the background color and use a different color so let me select a deep black color like this and i will copy this hex code and i will replace it here like this now we can also change the font family as well so i am using system ui font so you can use any other font like monospace and it will apply to the hero section so you can individually change the font for the heading as well let me click on that and instead of system ui let me select monospace and you can see it is how it looks now let's select different font here so as you can see the font is changing like this so you can use any different font and you can also use font weight and it will show like this so this is how you can change the font as well so you can change the color of this text like this so let me switch to yellow now let's go to h2 and let's change this text to let's say i want to change it to white like this now we have set a margin top of one rem and you can reduce the margin if you want let's say 0 0.7 rem or 0 0.1 so in this way you can set the top margin and we have set the font size to 2 rem so let's change it to 2.1 or 2.5 like this and this is how you can increase the font size so you can use rem or you can use let's say 25 pixel and let's increase this value to something like 45 pixel so you can use pixel ram em all these values so make sure to customize it according to your choice and according to your branding you can change the color background color you can change the link of the button and if you still have doubt customizing the hero section then you can ask me in the comment section and don't forget to hit the like button and i recommend you to follow our telegram channel where you can get regular updates from our videos thank you